with our feet shoulder width apart. That's it. And warming everyone. Now we're going to warm up our, our joints, fingers together, shoulders relaxed, and just roll those muscles, uh, those wrists around, keeping our muscles relaxed. You can do one at a time if you like, or one after the other, and do it the other way if you can. Very good. Put your hands on the tummy. Okay, playing teacher here. Remember now. So thumbs in the front. Bring your wrists forward. So you tickle your tummy. That's it, Teo, bring your thumbs forward, that's it. Now lie your hands sideways, and now put your hands back on your tummy. Forward and tickle your tummy, round to the sides, and back. Forward and tickle, forward. Forward, tickle the tummy first, now that's it. Round and back. See, make little circles. So tickle the tummy, then lie sideways, and then bring the hands back. Tickle the tummy, that's it. Good, very good. Speed that up, making a little circle. That's it. Chanel, tickle the tummy. Good. That's a tail. A little bit slower. Very good. Bring the arms down. And now our shoulders. Looking straight ahead. And just roll the shoulders. That's it. Go back into forwards. Tail, shoulders now. Put the hands down by your sides. Hanging nice and loosely. Good. Shoulders first. Lift the shoulders up. Shrug. Oh dear. Lift a side. Go the other way if you like. That's it, Paul Drake. Shrugging the shoulders. Nice. Now bring your hands across. Now we're going to swing our elbows back, okay? Keep your arms nice and relaxed. Elbows go back and across. Elbows, just like you're nudging someone behind you. Elbows. Okay, keep your hands up here by your tummy. Crossed. Elbows. Now swing wide with your arms opening. Wide and cross. Wide. Good. And look at my palms. My palms go to face forward, thumbs on top. That's it. And just swing nice and loosely. Nice and loosely. And our elbows again. Elbows back. Elbows. 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 Arms wide. Arms wide. Arms wide. Arms wide. Elbows. Arms wide. Elbows. Arms wide. Elbows. Arms wide. Good. Good. Hands out in front. Thumbs close. Bend your elbows. Bring your hands back to your tummy. And then just push them out to the side. And then circle them around to the front. Back to the tummy. And just like you're polishing your table. Hey, Baldrick, stay standing over there so you've got some room to move your arms. Good. And bend the elbows slowly to the top. Baldrick, circle those that's it. Very good. Hands on your hips. And now make sure your knees are bent. So just a little bounce if you're standing. And now just rotate. And if you're sitting down, just turning your chest from side to side. Mark, just turning the shoulders. That's it. Left and right if you're standing. Hands on hips. That's it. Very good. Go the other way. Circle the other direction. Nice and slow, slow down, slow down. Bring your hands down to your sides. I'm going to turn our bodies and sit down, swing and hit our body. That's it. At the front, see the hand that's in the back. The other hand at the front and then you swap. Just nice and loose. Excellent. Very good. Keep the arms nice and low. Let the hand go behind you so it goes to the bottom. That's it. Now the one comes around against the front. Change the arms. That's it. Very good. Face in the front. Hands together. If you can, turn your palms down. Look at my elbows. Nice and bent. I'm just going to lift them up to my chest. If I can go higher and look underneath, that's comfortable for me. I'll do that. I'll bring my arms slowly down. Now keep your shoulders relaxed. Bend the elbows. Okay, bend the elbows. Good. And slowly up like your crane. And down. Good. Nice stretch. Very good. That's it. Hold well on. Bring them up. Hug your head if it's comfortable. And down. Or if you like, just bring your hands up to your chest. Good. And down again. Good. Give your arms a shake. Bring your hands together again. Same thing if you can. Palms down. Elbows bent. Shoulders relaxed. 
and this time we're going to lift them up and hold them in front of us here and now you're going to just turn your hips and your body like a lighthouse imagine there's a torch and you're using your body to shine that torch all around the room that's it nice and slowly Let's check who's got their knees bent just a little bit bent that's it ball drip you're going just keep turning left and right Back to the centre. Bring the arms down. Ooh, good. Give them a shake. Shoulders a shake. If you're standing, bring your feet together. If you're comfortable with your shoes touching, then your knees should touch. If you're comfortable standing with your feet apart, then keep your knees apart. If you're sitting, bring your shoes and feet together. Right. Bending those knees. Cross your hands. Put your hands on your knees. Relax your muscles of the legs and do little circles. Just little circles. That's it. That's a ball drip. Bring out and touch the knees. Oh, that's it. Circle them and circle the other way. Just small circles. And if you're sitting, hands on your knees here and you can just gently move your knees side to yeah. side. Just warming the joints up. And slowly coming up. Open the legs wider. Just stand up a little bit over this way, project, so that Taylor's got some room. So we're going to bring the knees a bit wider than shoulder width. Look at my toes, they're pointing just slightly outwards. Now just turn your toes out a little bit. No, outwards, that's it, that's it. Now we're going to do our squats. So you push your hips backwards and then rest on your knees. Okay, like you're saying hello to a little dog. Yep. And now you're going to use your hands to keep your knees open and you're going to just drop your bottom down and backwards. And slowly come up. So tail your bottom backwards. Don't put the knees forward. Don't come forward. I want your bottom to go back. That's it. Very good. Keep your toes on the ground. Feet on the ground. Excellent. Little push back. Keep the hands for stretch. Bend your knees. Softening. Let those hips sink down. Knees bend. Hands on knees. Squat it down. That's it. Very good. And one more. And then slowly come up. Bring the feet in a bit closer. And now standing. Just a little bit closer. Right on the screen. Not everyone wants to see that. And step over the screen. Keep going. That's it. Standing on one leg. And your left leg here, just tap on the ground. See my heels not touching the ground, and my knees bent. And I'm going to make a circle with this leg. Goes across my foot and back, across the back. Circle the knee. See if you're going sideways. Like a That's it. And the heel. Don't lift the heel up too high. You just leave the heel down there, and just the circle. Circle the other way. You can go back in other direction. Nice and slow. That's it. That's pretty good. That's it, bar. Keep moving. Changing legs. So stand on your left leg. Tap the right here. So it's only just loosely touching the ground. And circle that knee. Good. This is good because it makes the ankle move very gently. And the hip move. And the knee drop move. Warming them up. This leg here. Hold it. Circle that knee. That's it. And go back the other way. Make the circle the other direction. Keep doing it. And we see at least 10 circles. That's it. Five. Keep going. Eight. Nine. Ten. Well done. Standing on both feet. Now here's our balancing exercise. Does anyone need a chair to hold on to like a chair for now just to help balance? No, you're fine. So if you want, you can hold on to a chair. Just, just loosely with your fingers. The rest of us can stand nice and tall. I want you to just bounce your knees so your knees are soft. There, bounce the knees. Let me see your soft knees. Now you let your weight go down into your right knee. That's it, you feel the left heel come off the ground. Looking straight ahead, keeping that hip nice and soft. Just lift the knee and the toe off the ground and place it back. Good. And swap into the other leg. Remember, no teapots, we're not leaning, we're nice and straight. And then when you feel that all your weight is on this leg here, lift the knee, just check. Very good. Very good, Sean. And bring your weight down slowly into your right leg. And when the heel's off, just lift the toe. So don't lift it too soon, okay? 
Make sure that you have brought all your weight down into your leg. Shift the weight over the tail. Shift the weight. Hold it, let me see you put the weight into one leg. And when you feel there's no weight in this leg, you just check. Good. And down into the right leg. Bring the weight over. Don't just lift your heel up, bring the weight over. And now remember, you've got to have this joint here. It's got to be your finger there. You've got to feel like you're trapping your fingers when you lift your knee. You can feel that in there. So we don't lift up the hip because that makes us into a teapot. Teapot's doing. Okay. That's creating toe hips from step one. And now the other leg. Transfer your weight down. Take your time. Put your finger here. Switch your finger. Lift. That's excellent. Very good. And now turning, facing this direction to the left, put the left heel out with the toe up. And push your bottom backwards. Push back, see, and it bends the body and put your hands on your knees. And now just pull the toe upwards. Pull that toe up, feel the stretch, lift the toe up. Can you feel a stretch along here? Yes, me. And then slowly come up, change your legs to the other side, put the heel out, push your bottom back. And then lift that toe up. Careful not to have your weight on this leg. Standing on this leg here mostly. Pull up the toe. And slowly come up. And now just swing those hands and crossing. And now you can shift from leg to leg. So we're coming back to their positions. All right, so feet, how, how far apart should our feet be? Shoulder width. Okay, shoulder width. Standing nice and tall for our standing postures. If you're sitting, just sit with your feet flat on the ground and softly bring your arms up, making a circle here. In front of the chest, palms are facing in. Hands are nice and curved. Fingers are slightly open, that's it. Just bend the knees a little bit so you know your knees are slightly bent. Shoulders relaxed, very good. Make sure your elbows aren't touching your body. Chanel, just lift your elbows a little bit, that's it. Lift them up a little. Very nice. Tao, lift your elbows up. Good. It's like you're making, you're holding a great big bowl. Arms wrapped around a big bowl. Mm. That's good. Just drop them a little lower bar. Yeah, see, when you drop your shoulders and you relax your elbows as well. Just staying quietly. So, Baldrick. Just focus straight ahead. Stop moving the body if you can. Perfect. It's Alex. Hands down in front of your chest. Yeah. Okay, now, moving on, lifting the sky, turn your palms, one up and one down. Palm facing up, lift it. Until it's in front of you like a high five or waving hello and drop the other hand down to the ground. Now turn the hand that's down by the ground and start to lift that up and drop the other one down. Turn the palm so it's forward, like you're waving hello. Now fingers, tail, soften the hand, nice curved hand. So they're not spiky fingers, nice and curved. Turn the hand at the bottom, changing arms. Turn your palm out. Very nice. Turning, that's it, ball drag. Lifting up, the other hand up. Perfect. Well done, Alex. One up, now changing arms. Changing arms. Turn the hand, changing arms. And now bring your hand down, so both hands, both arms hanging down. Turn the palms. Next exercise. Catching the chi and up. Shoulder height and bring your hands over slowly down. Turn your palms. Keep your shoulders relaxed. If the hands extend out, see this slightly in front of the body. Over the tops, your palms are facing down and slowly down. We try and keep the same speed. Lifting them up. Over the top, that's it, and slowly down. Very good. Keep the shoulders nice and relaxed when you bring your hands down. All the way down. Very nice. If you're sitting, bring your hands down and just place them on your thighs. Turn the, turn the palms of the arms up. 
and bring them down. Good. Now change your next exercise, catching the air. Bend your elbows to your hands, travel up your tummy, touching your tummy with your fingers, up to your chest. Turn your palms out. Then turn your body just slightly to the corner and let your hands come forward. Push forward with the hands. Make fists. Face the front, bring your hands straight down. Straight down here on your legs. Open your hands. Bring them slowly up. Travel up your tummy. That's it to your chest. Turn your thumbs down. Turn and push your hands slightly forward. That's it. Make your fist and then bring them back down onto your legs. Good. Bend the elbows and bring your hands up. Turning and bring them forward. Nice and slow. Make your fists and bring them down. Open your hands, drag them up your tummy slowly to the chest. Just turn the other way. Thumbs are down. Expand the hands forward. Very good. Move this way. Turn close. That's it. Bring your hands down. Bringing the arms up slowly. It's a metaphor. Turning. Nice turn. Good. That's it. Now bring the hands down. Last one. Bend the elbows. See the hands travel up the body. That's it. Keep the hands here still. Turn your thumbs down. Go forward. Push the palms out. That's it, Chanel. Well done. Bring the arms down. Good. Facing the front. Next exercise. Spreading the wings. Cross your hands. Bend your elbows. Your fingers are there. Pointing upwards. Lift to your face. Push your hands forward and let them open. Okay. So they're slightly in front. My palms are down. Bring them forward to you. A little bit in front of you. And now, softly, you're going to bend your elbows, your hands come in a bit, and then spread your wings back out, bringing them down. Cross your wrists, bend the elbows, lift them up, open the window, push and open, bend the elbows down, arms go back out, bring them down. Crossing, bend the elbows, lift the arms, pushing open. Now watch when I bend my elbows, do they touch my body? I bend my elbows? No, they don't. They don't touch my body. Just a little bend, then spread them back out. Spread them out there, good. Bring your arms down. Crossing, lifting, push open. You're gonna change direction, turn your palms up. I want you to bring your wrists and your elbows close. Ah, they cross, drop them down, and they'll open. And now lift your hands back up to our wings position, and spreading the wings. In with the elbows and out. Turn your hands, crossing. Gym. Elbows Gym. almost cross, wrists across, Gym. down, Gym. and up, ball drip, open Gym. arms up, good. Elbows in Gym. and out, slowly ball drip, slowly, crossing, good. Bringing them down, up, drop the elbows, and out. Next exercise, I want you to turn, holding the ball, that's a tail, turn your body a little bit. Hold the ball in front of you, ball drag. Hold the ball in front of you, that's it. Now turn your body and roll the ball over so the other hand is on top. Good. Now remember this ball is a basketball, okay? Not a cricket ball. Open up, drop your hand down here by your tummy, that's it. And turn and roll the ball over. That's it, so one hand's in front of your chest, the other's down here by your tummy. Turn your body and change over. Good, that's it Chanel. Turn the body a little more. Turn your body. Turn, look over there. Turn your body that way. Good. And then turn back and look over here towards the bookshelf. No. Good. That's it. Turning. Elbow tail. Drop your elbow. Turning. Good. Drop the elbow tail. Down. Elbow down. And then come back to the center. Open and closing. Like the accordion, the hands come and they're almost touching here. And then open. Draw the hands in slowly. They almost it's touch, but not quite. And then let them open. Expand just wider than your body. Nice, that's it. And if you're sitting, just a little turn. Hands just move with the body, with the waist. From one leg to the other. And now facing the front, bring the arms down. If you're sitting, put your hands on your legs, on your thighs, and if you're standing, let your hands hang down. Softly, relax your shoulders, and start to let the arms lift up like a zombie, until they're almost shoulder height. Bend your elbows. When you bend your elbows down, the hands 
Come back almost to your chest, but don't squish it. Just halfway. And now drop your hands down onto your thighs. Let them hang down if you're standing. Lift them up. So slide as you're sitting, slide the hands off your legs and lift up like a zombie in front of you. Bigger zombie. Teo, point. Yeah, that's it. Very good. Bend your elbows and bring your hands down. And softly up, stretch them forward. Bend the elbows and bring the arms down. All the way down to your legs. And keep it nice and slow. Up, bend the elbows and then slowly down. Don't drop them fast. That's it. Very good. Up, bend the elbows and back. Remember, you have to stretch them right out in front of you. Ooh. Otherwise, you've got nothing to bend. So, Chanel, bring the stretch them Flesh. right. Yes. And now bend Flesh. the elbows. Flesh. But when you stretch Flesh. them out, Flesh. make sure your elbows Flesh. are soft so it's not really Flesh. stiff. Flesh. They're soft. And then you bend the elbows down to the ground. And your hands will follow. Very good. And relax. Give yourself a shake. Give yourself a pat on the back. Give yourself a round of applause. All right. So we just have a little break and then we'll do our silk reeling. Okay? So just go and grab a drink of water. Silk reeling is about making these lovely big circles. Lovely big circles with our arms, but the most important thing, Teo, do you remember? It's turning the body, right? Yeah. That's it. See how Teo is turning the body? So we're going to start by just doing that. So you put your hands here on your hips, and you're just turning, and it's a little turn, not a big twist, okay? Just a small turn. And should our knees be long or straight, or should they be bent? What do you think, Val? Should we have our knees bent or straight? Straight. Val! <laughs> if we have them straight, we might hurt them. We've got to have them a little bit bent. Sorry. A little bit bent. Bent. Yeah, bent. I can see yours are bent. You were doing it, saying the opposite. Good. So our hands are here, just on our hips. So imagine our tummy buttons just moving. That's it. Little turn. And now when you turn to the right, you put out your right arm. Now look, my thumb's on top and my palm's facing forward. I'm going to turn my body and I'm going to bring my hand with me across Sorry. the floor like yeah, it's through the water. I'm going to lift it up and then yeah. when I'm facing this way, I'm going to put my thumb down so my front of my face, my palm is facing away. Turn your thumb down. Good. And I'm going to turn my body, my hand goes back along the top, circles down. I'm going to keep doing this. Turn the body and up and turn. Very nice, Val. Good. Good. Bring the hand down. I'm sorry. Turn. So don't forget to turn your body, Chanel. Turn your hips. Look over there. Turn the that's it. That's it, Case. Okay. See how very nice. Nice and slow and turning across and down. Change direction. Let's put our thumb inside and turn your body. Look, the hand goes the other way. Sweep it across the floor and then over the top. Just imagine. You are dragging your hand through the water, you lift it up, and when you turn, you wipe your fingers across the wall. Then you bring your hand down, and you drag it through the water, you lift it up, you turn your body, and your fingers wipe on the wall. Very good. Down. Let's draw the other hand in, do one circle together. Through the water, up, and across the wall. And now just our left hand, put this hand on our hip. Oh. Turn the body through the water and up, thumb under, very nice foul, across and down. Through the water, that's it. And up and across. Good. Turning. Good. Keep it nice and slow, nice and slow. And across. Good. This time we'll change direction. Turn the hand, sweep through the water, and across. That's it. Keep turning the body, not too big a turn, okay? Keep the, turn the body quite small, quite small. That's it. So it's slow and gentle. Slow and gentle. Good. All right, now watching me, okay? Watching me. This is the difficult one. This hand will come down, and we'll lift this hand up. And hold them there. And now turn your body. 
Mm. Change your arms. Mm. This one down in front of you, that's it. Lift this one up at the side. Mm. Yep, lift the other up at the side. Good. Now turn, hold the arms and turn the body. Bring this arm down, that's it. Down and lift the other one up at the side. That's it. Hold it there and turn your body. That's it. Turn the body. Good. And down. Change the arms. This one up and turn your body. Very good. Hold it there. I want you to flip your hands around. Good. Keep your hands here. Turn your body back. Turning, turning, turning. Good. Now drop this arm down. Bring this one up in front of your face. Good. And turn your body. Bring this arm down to the side and this one up in front of your face. Yeah, that's it. And turn your body. Bring this one down, this one up in front of your face. That's it. And turn your body. Very good. Now bring this arm down. So both hands are down. So these hands together are going to make the circles. Turn your body. Two hands across the floor. Both hands up. Look at my, look at my thumb. This is One's up, one's down, my fingers are pointing away, my hands are face forward, and I just turn my body, sweep across, bring my hands down, cross the floor, and up, I turn so my hands are outwards, my palms are outwards, and turn the body, turn, 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 good, bring them down, turn across, and lift the arms up, take care of so I want to be able to see the see your palms. Turn your hands like you see your palms. It's as if you're grabbing something. And turn. Good. Bring them down. And across. Other way. Ball drink. Go the other way. Keep two feet on the ground. Always two feet on the ground. Turn your body. And up. My palms are out. Good. And I turn. Bring them down. Excellent. Across the floor up and turn the body. Bring your hands down. That's a toe. Keep following me across this way. And lift them up and turning. Very nice. Okay, now we've got our new cross arms that we've learned recently. So we bring the arms up and this time when we turn, we're going to cross our arms. Cross the wrists. Make sure they're crossed. Good, yes. Cross together so they're touching. And now drop your hands down. And now when you turn, open them, either side of your body. They come up, nice and high here, about head height. Open, that's it. And now when you turn, let the hands cross so your wrists touch. Good, now bring them down. Keep standing upright. And now turn your body and they open, either side of your body, and lift them up. Lift them up. And turn and they cross, that's it Chanel. Then drop them down, all the way down. Turn your body and now open and lift them up. Turn your body and they'll cross. That's a cross and bring them down. All the way down. Stand up, Taylor. Don't lean over. Turn your body, let them open, open, open. See how wide they go. Open them and then they can lift up. Turn and they cross and bring them down. Really good, everyone. That's pretty tricky. All right, facing the front. I want you to turn out your right. Uh, your left toe a bit, and I just take half a step forward with the other foot. Okay, so see our feet, one foot is forward and facing in front, and the other foot's just a bit behind. So you should feel quite comfortable. So bring this foot forward, Bar. Step the other one forward. That's it. Good. So Baldrick, you need to step up, move over there, sit on top of Teo, and put one foot in front. Baldrick, one foot in front. Very good. So you all feel comfortable standing like that? Good. And now we're going to reel our hands in backwards, cycling backwards. So the hands come out in front of us and up in front of our face and back. And then the other one does it. That's it. So they call it bicycle hands. That's it, Bar. I'm going to try and keep both hands going all the time. Backwards, Chanel. Towards your face. Towards your face. That's it. That's it. So when one hand is going up, the other's coming down. So I don't leave one hand there and then do the other one. I'm doing both at the same time. They never stop. Those two. Good, but even smaller. Even smaller. Okay. Backwards. There you go. Baldrick, can you see? Backwards with the hands. That's a tail. Back towards your nose. That crazy right there. Good. And look at my body. My body still does a little bit of a move. 
So you can do a little turn of the body. See that bud? Chanel, let's just see the body turn a little bit. Slow down, slow down, nice and soft. Good. And we stop and you've got your right hand in the air. Right hand in the air. And you're going to, your foot that's in front, just turn the toe out a little bit. And then half a step forward, the other foot. Good. So now we've got the other foot in front. A little bit more in front there, Teo. Ball drink. Other foot in front. That's it. Very good, Vark. We'll bring it forward a little bit more towards me. Step it to me. No, no, step towards me. There you go. That's it. There you go. All right. Very good, Chanel. And go forward this time with the arms. Forwards. Push forwards. Like a tray. Like you're running. Vars running backwards. Run forwards, Var. Yeah. Run forwards. For forwards. Go this way. That's it. Run forwards. Yeah. Like the tray. Good. Chanel, let the hand come right down so it touches I'm your leg. Sorry. Right down. That's it. That's it, Teo. Very good. Nice. Good. Keep it nice and slow. I'm sorry. Baldrick, let me see you do your running hands. I'm sorry. Go forwards, Baldrick. Push forwards. And you too, Alex. Show me those arms. Running forward. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good. 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 And once again, the right hand in front. Hold it up to stop there. This is how we finish this exercise. I want you to bring your feet parallel, which means they're shoulder width standing next to each other. And your toes are in a nice line. Teo, bring your feet. Maybe you need some help. Bring foot forward. Bring that foot forward. It's when you say. Baldrick, we're about to finish. You ready? Bringing your right arm down. Okay. And now we finish. We're down pressing, catching the chi. Bring your hands down. Just nice and relaxed. This exercise is great when you just want to calm down. Take your big breath in. You can let the breath out. The hands go down. Nice and relaxed. Very good. And give your body a shake. So that's our silk reeling. So now we're just going to do a little bit of our footwork. So focusing on the feet. Well, let's see, focus on my feet here. Mm -hmm. All right, so our feet together or close, whatever's comfortable for you. I want you to just tap your left foot here, just the toes. So the heel is on the ground. You can wiggle your toes if you like. And just turn your toe out and turn it back. I'm sorry. Now, that's great, everyone. You see, the heel stays on the ground. You just turn and turn it back. And we don't turn it too far. Just 45 degrees out and back. Good. This time you can turn it out and you're going to stand on it and bring the other foot in and put the toes next in, in a line. So the foot's next to it, shoulder width apart. And look, you're facing the other direction. Come back to the front, feet together. Let's try on the other foot. So just tap or wiggle your right toes, keeping the heel on the ground. Just turn. That's it. Turn the toe out. That's a bit easier. And bring it back again. Let's see, Baldrick, turn the toe out and back. So don't lift up the heels, okay? Keep the heel on the ground, turn it out. That's it, and turn it back. Good. Now we're going to do our little step. So wriggle the toes, turn it out. Turn it out, easier, that's it. Now stand on that leg and put the other one shoulder width apart with the toes in line. That's it, bring this foot round, that's it. Far, very good. And just stand. And look, we've managed to face the other direction. Stay there. I'm just going to turn to face the same way as you. All right? This leg here, okay? Which is your right one. Just tap the toe for me. Very good. I want you to turn this toe in just a little bit. Good. Now you stand on that leg and turn this one out to the other corner. Very good. Pop the toe down. That's it, Baldrick. Put the toe down. And now stand on this leg and put your other foot with the toes in the line next to it. And then change direction. Brilliant. Let's try the other way. Tap this toe. That's your left leg. Okay, or the one at the back if you like. Turn your toe in a bit. Stand on that leg and turn the other toe out to the corner. 
Good. And then walk on that leg and touch the other one. Parallel. Toes in a nice line. Feet to shoulder width. Excellent. Now we're going to turn to the front. So we take the right leg. Tap the toe here. Or wiggle it. Turn it in a little bit. Now turn this toe to the front. Okay, not too far. Teo, turn it to the front, bring it back a bit. Yep. And now we're going to stand on it and put the other foot next to it. So now we're facing the front. Who's facing the front? Woo! Everyone. Well done. That's the footwork. Should we try that again? Step back. Okay. We'll do a couple of rounds of footwork and then we'll add some arms. All right, so standing here, watching me, everyone. Okay, so we start by tapping our right foot. We can turn that foot out. We stand on it and put the other foot there. Good. Let's turn back to the front. We start with this foot. Turn your toe in. This one here is to go first. Turn your toe in a little bit. That's it. Stand on it. Turn this toe out to the front. And step and put the feet parallel. Excellent. Let's try again. Turn this foot out. Step on it. And turn this foot in. And this foot out. And come to the front. Good. All right. Take one step back. Let's try some arms. So we'll do a little bit of the arms and include our, our um, footwork. So. It's the beginning of our four steps. Some of you will remember this. So we start with our zombie warm up. All right, so relaxing the shoulders. Baldrick, you're watching me? Baldrick? Baldrick, watching? Arms coming up. That's it. And bring the arms back and bring them down. Turn your hands to the right with your body. And then turn back. Silk really go along the floor. Lift your arms up. Start to turn. And I want you to turn your right toe out. Good. Keep your arms up. And I want you to walk onto that leg and put the foot side by side. Excellent. I want you now, I'm just going to change the face direction, same as you. I want you now to turn the silk wheel on your arms to the back of the room. Go the other way, Val. Turn the other way. Other way. That way, and that bring way, your hands down, way. circle down, yeah. down. That's it, turning. Now you've got to use your feet. Turn, this toe in, this toe out. Good. And I want you to bring your foot slightly in front. That's it, good. And then from here, that's it. Lift up, other, other foot. And then lift up your arm. Excellent. Very good. Try that again. All right, we'll try that one more time. So step back. Okay, so I'm going to start facing you so you can see what my hands do, and then I'll turn so you can follow my feet. All right, nice and tall. Okay, feet nice and still, Chanel. Lovely. That's it, very good. A little bit wider. Can you see a bit wider with your feet too? Nice and still, everyone. Relax your shoulders, arms begin. Back up to it. Bend the elbows. Bring them down. Our silk really making our circles. We turn the body and our hands to the right. Turn the palms and then sweep along the floor. And lift them up. Hold them up here. Then as you turn your body, I want you to turn your right toe out. Right toe. That's it. Stand on that leg and put the other foot parallel. Good, and your hands are still up. Excellent, yeah, stay there. Turn your face, yeah. same direction as you. And now turn towards the back of the room. Other way, Val, turn the other way. That's it, bring your hands down. Bring the hands down, sweeping across the floor. Good, and now turn your body. Not too far, Val, with your hands, bring them over your feet, good. Now here's your footwork. Turn your toe in, turn the other toe out. And I want you to bring your right foot forward. That's it. Very good. Very good. Lifting your arm up. No, I'm, this one, so I lift arm up. Good. Mm. Excellent. Well done. Very good. So that's the beginning of the four step. Okay, you managed to learn that all in one day. 
Thank wow. you very much. So we finish with our martial arts bow, so an open hand, I don't mind which one it is. Put your fist in there and push it forward. Thank you very much, everyone. And hopefully I'll see you all next week. Okay? Well done, Taylor. Goodbye. Yay. Thank you. It's great. Concentrate. Val, you remember so much. Yep. Very good. Yeah, very good. Very good. Well done, Alex. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.